I haven't felt as loony as I did last night for a very, very long time. Shoot, 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 shoot. Hello there. So I actually arrived at university six hours ago, and as you know, when you arrive at university, it's it's ba you basically go straight into freshers. And just so you have a bit of context, Freshers Week is basically the welcome week for when you arrive at university. That uh, is basically just full of social events, and hopefully gives you the chance of making new friends and also settling in before your uni work starts. And I actually have an event that I'm already booked in to go to, which starts at seven o'clock. So I'm probably gonna be late because it's literally like six forty right now. And well, I probably still need to get ready to be honest. Like going out in tracksuit is my first day. It's not the best impression. So yeah, I'm gonna get ready. Oh. What do we think, by the way? Do we think the jumper's too much? Like, I'm trying to make the impression that I know how to dress, but I also, like, am not trying too hard. But the thing is, I feel like this jumper's kind of maybe trying too hard. I don't know. Like, I'm kind of panicking. Like, this is what I wore out when I went to Paris, but now I feel like I'm trying too hard. I don't, oh, I don't know, man. Like, my, my flat isn't that social. Like, I mean, hanging around the kitchen all day in the hope that I'd find someone to go to this event with tonight. But I haven't even really been able to meet anyone in the flat that's actually going to the event or even any going anywhere tonight. So I'm just going to go by myself. So I'm kind of, I don't know. Uh, am I trying too hard? I don't know. Oh. I don't know, I'm just nervous because I haven't really been in a situation where I don't know anyone for a long time and it, it scares me. <clears throat> Anyways, I guess this night is just one of those nights in your life that you just have to do. Like, I mean, not knowing people is just generally really scary. But I mean, once I've met a few people, it'll be fine. And, oh, I can't even remember the last time I did my hair. Bougie. Bougie. All right, let's go. So yeah, anyways, I'm going to be fashionably late for this and uh, yeah, I'll see you in a bit. Went off to go get some drink, I got fucking soaked. Not ideal. Like, of course it's just got to completely rain out on my first day at uni though. Of course it does. Oh, that is banging. That is actually banging. Oh, fucking hell, I'm tired. Oh. The thing is though, right, I'm not even like sleep deprived. I'm actually, it's the social side of it. I'm not used to like having to constantly talk to people. Like the event last night that I went to just felt like speed dating. Like it was, it was ridiculous. Like I must have spoken to about 40 people and had the same conversation with every single one. I mean, I, I quite enjoyed it. I met some all right people, but <sighs> bloody hell. I don't know how people talk to people the whole time. Like social interaction is tiring. The thing is as well, like last night was so random. Like it was basically like a cross between a year seven disco and then like a pub, which was quite cool. It was a weird, it was a weird mix. And then funny story. Well, I think it's a funny story. I actually ended up leaving the party at like 11.30 because it wasn't that great. And then this girl said that she had afters at hers and by afters she meant banana bread. Like that was what she meant. Like we went back to her flat and she gave us banana bread and tea. <laughs> Like, what? I don't know, it was an interesting experience. But yeah, anyways, I'll see you whenever I next see you. So how's it going? I'm feeling a little bit rough today. Not very rough, but just a little bit rough. Because I got back in at like 4.30 last night, so... I'm gonna say, just an absolute legend. Anyways, it's actually Tuesday now. We're not even gonna discuss what happened on Sunday evening. Yesterday was Monday morning, you know, I started my lectures on the third day of Freshers. I don't even know how that works. But anyways, we got an iPad. I had a 9 a.m. as well yesterday, it was not ideal. So after I managed to hustle my way through my lectures, we then had the Medical Society boat trip, which uh, was interesting to say the least. Basically, I don't know how anyone else is, but my social battery runs out about after two hours. So after about two hours of talking to people on this boat party, I sobered up and then I had like, I couldn't, I, 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 I struggled. I struggled to talk to people, like it was painful. The thing is, well, I couldn't even really drink on the boat because drinks were literally like 12 quid. It was, it was it was ridiculous. You know, it was all right. I met some actually quite nice people, so it's all good. And then after we did the boat tour, I then went to a club, which was just not a good idea. Like the club was just really not good and I couldn't get any alcohol after 11. So I walked into a club absolutely stone cold sober. And uh, yeah, the club was Tiger Tiger, which is also incidentally a club that I went to in Magaluf. Both were absolutely terrible. I think it's more to do with the fact that it's a freshers event. And then after leaving the club at three o'clock, we then had an hour and a half walk in the pouring rain, which I don't know why I did. I should have just got an Uber back to here, which was um, great. I actually passed Buckingham Palace. It was quite cool. We did like a little, we did like a little detour. It's actually freshers fair today, which I need to go and do. Um, it's one o'clock, so I might have missed it. I don't really know what's happening. It started at nine o'clock. But yeah, I'm gonna go and head there now. I haven't actually eaten breakfast yet. I think I'm gonna hopefully get some food there if they have food. Otherwise, I'm going to be struggling. I might pass out of Freshers Fair. That'd be pretty embarrassing. But yeah, just to give you a little brief summary. Basically, Freshers Fair is where you sign up for societies. Imperial actually has the most societies in every uni in the whole of the UK, which is bizarre. It's actually, it's got 360, I think. So yeah, we're probably going to find some very different societies, but it'll be cool. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead there now and um, I'll catch up with you whenever. <laughs> So 
So how's it going? It's actually been a few days since I last updated you, and to be honest, like, oh, a lot, a lot's happened. A lot's happened. It's now Thursday, and yeah, to be honest, I'm, I'm, I'm struggling with freshers now. This is genuinely not something that I thought I'd be saying. Like, to be honest, I'm really socially struggling. Like, I was backing myself to slot in perfectly, but it's safe to say that I haven't done that so far at all. So to get you guys up to speed real quick, basically on Tuesday was Freshers Fair, which was actually pretty good. I signed up for a lot of random societies. It's like there was a tea society, there was a kabaddi society. It was crazy. Like there was societies for literally everything. And then this is kind of where things start to go downhill because I then went to the Ministry of Sound in the evening. Evening, and literally I like, genuinely got so ill like I had eight pints and a bottle of wine before I went in and I blacked out And then yeah, you know how it goes I then spent the whole of yesterday in bed, which was um, not fun at all Anyways, although I did spend technically the whole of yesterday in bed I did actually end up going out in the evening It was more or less like a semi-initiation for some of like the sports clubs and stuff Which was quite fun. I did enjoy it. How it was like really socially awkward because I knew no one there and uh, yeah, I really struggled. And then we went to Heaven, which is actually a gay club, but basically the medical society booked out the whole thing. But it, so it was literally every single sports teams that took it. However, it was possibly single-handedly one of the worst evenings I've ever had. Like I left ridiculously early again. Like the music was so bad. I left by myself. Like it, I just, I just, I just really struggled because like, I didn't know people well enough there. And like yeah, it just wasn't great. But, yeah. Anyways, look. Honestly, I am really struggling a little bit. Like last night, I felt really quite lonely to be honest. Like I haven't felt as lonely as I did last night for a very, very long time. I'm hoping that at some point things will start to click. I think Freshers is a really difficult time because obviously you meet a lot of people that you aren't really like going to be friends with and then you meet some people that hopefully you'll be friends with but it's, it's just difficult and like I, I am really struggling with it to be honest. But yeah look I've actually decided to stay and I'm not really feeling like going out tonight to be honest. I've got to do some editing so we're just going to do that for this evening and, and hopefully fingers crossed things will be getting better but yeah I'll see you whenever I next see you because yeah I don't know when that's going to be. <laughs> I don't know where we are in the vlog at this point, but I thought I'd just update you on the fact that I got in at 7am yesterday, it's now 12 o'clock, and uh, I've got a football trial now, which I can't wait for. Like, if you watch my vlogs, you know I can't survive on no sleep. There's absolutely nothing better than doing the most exercise you've done in 20 months on 5 hours sleep and hungover. Honestly, I just want to die. Alright, anyways, let's get to this football trial. So it's update time. So obviously that last clip's gonna literally make zero sense. So let me give you some context. So on Thursday night, you know, I stayed in, I did some editing. I, I needed to recuperate, I, it had to be done. I was really struggling. Like I literally spent the entire day in bed and I needed to get some work done. So we, so that was Friday, it was, it was really uninteresting. It, was, it wasn't really a freshest day as per se, right? Then comes along Friday, which was, dare I say, very eventful. So to begin the evening, we actually had the welcome ball at Imperial, which Big Nasty performed that, which um, sounds really sick, but honestly, I didn't really rate Big Nasty. I, I, I literally left halfway through his performance. Having said that though, the guy that was DJing before him was actually sick, so I did really enjoy it, it was good fun. And then somehow I ended up in Kingston, which I don't know if you guys know Kingston, but Kingston is not in London. I didn't realise this. I thought Kingston was about 20 minutes away from here, but no. Kingston is basically in Devon, it's that far out of London. It took me an hour and a half to get there. But more or less, we ended up staying there till five in the morning. I know, I know. So I made it back home at about 6.30 this morning to then have a pizza because that was literally my breakfast. And then I had like a four hour sleep and then I had football trials. So now that we're all caught up, basically I went to football trials and I ended up chunning after about 10 minutes and I had to leave. Which wasn't great, but you know, I played some solid football. Honestly, the Eric Dyer-esque performance was noteworthy, but um, yeah, I'll probably end up playing like 13. It's not great, but it doesn't matter. So then basically I then spent the entire afternoon sleeping in my bed, which was honestly much needed, like much needed. But um, I'm still feeling pretty terrible now. And I wasn't going to go out, but um, I'm going out. I was actually persuading myself that I was actually going to get an Uber Eats and do watch the Netflix, but no. I'm going out. Fun, fun, fun. So yeah, I've got a house party now, which uh, I'm really kind of looking forward to and really not looking forward to. But yeah, we're gonna go to that now. One hour sleep. One hour sleep. I actually want to die. I, I want to die. So more or less the time is 3 o'clock. I ended up staying over at a friend's. Like, it was really good. I've literally never met any other influencers, but honestly, they were all really, really lovely, and I actually had a really good night. I mean, the flat party that we turned up to was a little bit tame, but I, I am dying now. I am beyond dying. I need to, I, I'm gonna have to go to sleep. I'm gonna have to go to sleep. It was a good night though, so yeah. Oh. So the time is now 7.30, I've just woken up and I'm feeling rough, rough, like rough, rough. I also think at this point that I picked up Freshers Flu. So yeah, it's not great. Anyways, look, I know this video's been totally different to any of my other vlogs, but I hope you've really enjoyed it. I've tried to keep it updated. It's been really difficult to fit in vlogging with like everything else that's going on because uh, yeah, I'm tired the whole time. But yeah, anyways, make sure you subscribe because I've got loads of other uni vlogs coming out and yeah, make sure you like, subscribe and yeah, have a nice day. <coughs> God, I feel dreadful.